you know what's going on. Wait, was oh, uh, I think that it actually said that there's someone who's going to attack me. Orton. There's nothing you can do about an offensive like that, especially when it's before a match. Yeah, the this fuck? Is just, I mean, oh. This is just way over the line. We were supposed to have a match here Fucking tonight. runs into me. And the DDT connects. Well, we're on the move here. Look out, the side slam might just finish this thing. That side slam hurts a lot worse than it looks. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. It's going to take a lot to change the tide of this Teach one. you, Randy. I'm not sure I can watch I'll teach this. you, Orton. Boom, 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 boom. Boom. Fucked up. Totally fucked up. <sighs> Please join me in welcoming my guest tonight. Let's talk about Randy Orton. Of course. He ambushed you during your own match tonight. What did that mean to you? It means I wrecked him. He wants a fight? If he wants a fight, he knows where to find me. It's not that difficult. And trust me, I'm ready for him. I'm not taking this lightly, and neither should he. I think I've beaten Randy Orton before. Like, early, early on in the there career. There's a lot of tension brewing between you two. What's going on there? What's going on? He is an asshole. I'm fired up. The chance to clash with him is getting me fired up. I know he'll bring the fight to me. But I don't know if he's ready for the fight I'm going to bring back to him. I'm serious about this. I'm bringing my A-game. Still not a face. I'm okay. Thanks for the time. Back to you. Well, that kind of sucked. I was actually looking forward to fighting Finn Balor again. That's okay. Because now I'm in a rivalry with Randy Orton. Orton. It's French. Orton. Okay. But what's my name? Seamus. Rocksteady. Great. Let's take on Rocksteady. Win your match without reaching level 3 stamina. Mm. We'll try. That's all you can really do is try. You Come on, Rocksteady. Ooh. Oh. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. And I know for a fact he's going to hit me. As we watch Seamus, let's get your take on him. Definitely yeah, so I far. fucking Hasn't taken called it. Punishment up to this point. Cuz he's a dirty bitch. He's a oh. vicious assault on that shoulder. Fuck out of here. Back in the ring now. Yeah, let's just see how long we can keep it in the ring. See how long we can keep it in the ring. Come on, Rocksteady. Now I don't have time for ring. this. Hey, Boom! What about putting a target on someone's back? Hey, too fast. I gotta watch my stamina a little bit. Come on, Rocksteady. There may be no stopping him. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. Nope. Quick 15 to avoid that. What was I trying to think about uh, suplexing a rhinoceros man? And that's the way he has to be if he wants to win here tonight. Ooh. Steady. There you go. There's a spear on a big rhino man. Get 
guess it's a good thing Gary Anthony Williams is not in this game. Then we also have to deal with the Bebop. Yay! And it all goes to shit. Okay, I'm at level two stamina, so I can't. I can't go down to level three. Fuck off. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. Are you kidding? Rope break. Thank you. Jerry, you brought up Sheamus's 2010 coronation after becoming king of the ring, and it was another instance where oh, my fucking God. intensity, desire, and ferocity. Well, no one ever said Sheamus was shy about making it known. He intended to assault the WWE record books. Yeah, Cole, I don't think Sheamus has ever been shy about anything. Nope, I'm fucking... I lost that mission big time. might lose this match too if I do I'm gonna say fuck being a face and I'm just gonna start going wild break his fucking face open break his fucking face open do it ooh, 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 ooh. Broken. Broken. Extra slow getting back to his base here. And did he counter that? No. Good. You have to wonder just how wide covers. It's like every time the, the camera changes after I do a move, I I get the gut instinct that he actually fucking counters it. Not gut instinct, but gut feeling. I'm gonna jump off the second rope because he can't hit me with a catching finisher. And I know the bro kick is a catching finisher. So I'm not gonna let him. I'm not gonna jump at him while he has his finisher. Nope. He might hit me with the bro kick anyway. Here it comes. Nope. He might have actually gone for his catch finisher there. Or tried to. Fortunately, I. Oh. And failed. Great. Fucking cocksucker. Jesus Christ. See, the reason why I'm having a little bit of issues with this game right now is because normally when I'm playing this game, I'm playing it in universe mode. And when I am playing it on universe mode, I am playing on legend. But I also have the reversal cues. Um, enabled so I can actually see the proper times of when to counter. That and I just recently got back into playing this game. Mixed with playing it on in career mode, which you start with a lower level character. And no reversal indicators. Makes for one hell of a fucking battle. Like, a lot of people will play on Legendary, but they'll have the, the reversal indicators on. 
or they'll have the reversal indicators off and they'll be playing on like hard or normal well I, i'm doing like the hardest of the hard so you have to kind of try to bear with me a little bit that's kind of why i'm i lose a lot of matches but at the same time i'm doing pretty fucking good for what i've tried to do so far And that's probably another reason why it's so difficult to get most of those missions done for the authority. But perhaps I am wasting my time by doing missions for the authority. When I could just be getting extra points for beating opponents in a high match as opposed to trying to do these stupid fucking authority missions and then just failing and losing even more points than I would have lost originally for just completing the match. It's a mixed bag, I tell ya. God fucking damn it. Okay. Sheamus mad. Hate that fucking beard of Seamus's. Probably downloads it illegally, dirty bitch. What's he doing? Oh my fucking god. Looks like he kind of collapsed after he did that move. And just like that, this move is leading the charge. Yeah, charge! Oh my oh, god, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get his ass back in here. Back into the ring now. Yeah, this is good. This is where the action needs to be. Are you serious? Oh, here we go with... Stamina Vampire. A minor miracle might be needed to Twilight Stamina the... Edition. Fuck over. No, don't let him kick out. If he kicked out, he would have gotten a signature. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. This match has taken so much out of this guy. Okay, this definitely gotta work on stamina regain. This has been physical. That is probably one of the top Watch things it. I need to increase. Submission locked in. And this might be it. And there's the release. What's going to happen now? I'm scared to ask. Out. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly. Real fucking fast. kidding me? Oh gosh. Hey, what do you want for your last meal? Nope. At complete nope. Counter. There's blood in the water. There's blood in the water. Bro. Bro, 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 fuck you, Seamus. One, two, three, fucking A. Rocksteady down and out. Here's your winner, Tony Sinister. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ, that was a pretty good match. To get the pinfall victory over such a high quality opponent is incredibly impressive, Michael. It'll be interesting to see the fallout following this big singles win. 1200. Holy shit.
There's absolutely nothing I can do with those personality traits. I guess once you're a heel, you're always a heel. Unless it takes something really, really big to switch to switch uh, morales. But I figured that helping out Sting would have would have gotten me eh, would have actually turned me face. But no, I got all my positive skills up. But I guess it's not enough. Okay, so my rank increased, number nine, because I just took Rocksteady out of the number nine position, so he's down to ten. I'm up to nine. The Ryback, Mark Henry, Randy Orton, Roman Reigns, Big Show, Dean Ambrose, Daniel Bryan, Brock Lesnar, and then Seth Rollins. But if all goes right, if everything goes the way I hope it does. Let's just say I could go from number seven straight to champion. It's a major hint of what I'm trying to accomplish. If you guys are having a little bit of trouble trying to think about what's going on, think about um, think about the months, like after WrestleMania. See, it's April now. You got May. And June, something around that time is what I'm kind of aiming for. Extreme rules. So we're going to face Dean Ambrose right now. And Randy Orton's facing Mark Henry, so I might have to watch that stupid match. That's okay. And my mission is perform two finishers during your match. Okay. That might happen this anyway. This is a war. A war where two men are going to attempt to tear each other limb from limb and pulverize one another beyond recognition. Ooh. King, we have a front row Dirty. Whoa. And a bit of a test of strength here. I love it. This is a good old fashioned battle of Motherfucker. power versus power. In your opinion, what is Sparks thinking about at this point? Well, luckily the body hasn't absorbed too much of an attack up to this point. That's what I'm thinking. He'll slap me in the corner. He looks I'll show you. Here. I'll show you. I'll show you. The lunatic fringe. Ooh. Oh, another head kick. Head trauma, head trauma. Trauma. Shot to the spine. Boy, he just got laid out. Unleashing it for the second time now. Drop kick to the knee. He may be trying to work on the leg a little bit. Just gonna wait for him to wake up. I'm gonna jump. Oh, we missed. Counter. My mini rock bottom. And we're gonna go for a high flying move. But he counters it. So. 
simply reminding him that he's here. This could end it in a hurry. Boom! Signature, he's already wasted. Like, what the hell? Oh. <sighs> Come on, get up. Someone really should check Neck out breaker. a maneuver like that takes your career and it just flashes it before Kick to the spine. Yeah, that wouldn't be a very long flash for just you, Just to but this guy's in establish dominance. Not today, too fast. Look out. Dominance. And here he comes. Great reversal. Oh. Pretty nice power bomb. What did he do? He just like wasted so much stamina. Now he's tired of shit. In the mid 2000s, Dean Ambrose became known on the independent wrestling circuit for taking and dishing out ungodly amounts of punishment. The fans around the world, Ambrose. Yeah, it's going to shorten his fucking career because of it. leader of the Hounds of Justice, known as the Shield. Oh, Ambrose emerged as the leader of the Shield, all right. When they arrived at WWE, the Hounds of Justice planned and carried out vicious attacks on all of WWE's most beloved heroes. his opponent to the limit here. Okay. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. Here we go. This could be it. Another signature. DDT. Ooh, that's ugly. Wow. He's and... still down after that. The end may be near. And there one. Sparks is now in charge here. Dean Ambrose has got to get something going for him in this match. Oh, here we go. Dean Ambrose is going to close it out. The lunatic friends may have things well in hand. Nope. The shoulders are... And he kicks out. And he lives to fight again. Still not beat. Oh, wow. Oh, what a shot. The big counter. Ow. Oh. More head trauma. Beating. That that's fine. Oh, you never know what Dean Ambrose is thinking. That's what makes him so dangerous. Fucking vampire moves. Crippler cross face. Look at that shit. Just a dominating oh, we're not beating him yet. Yeah, I think we could see a lot of punishment inflicted here. Oh, wow. He uh, countered whatever I was going to do there. Quite viciously, I might add. Nope. To avoid that. The the Ow. <laughs> Ow. What is he gonna do here? Oh. This is just a vicious attack here by Dean Ambrose. Plenty of back behind that kick. Hmm. Nope. Countered it. Today, too fast. What is he doing? He's just wasting stamina by turning me around. This one's not Must think I'm a flapjack or something. People come back from being in a lot Some kind of fucking pancake. What and are Dean you Ambrose doing? And he breaks the cover, no. Forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. You know, it's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in his tank. What? Okay. 
That took me forever to fucking turn around. Oh, nice DDT there. Oh my god. Reversed his signature, but I couldn't follow up with a proper move. He cannot capitalize on anything that he's doing. Will this be enough? Hang on. Yeah, the shoulders up now. That's a nope. kick out. Nice. Uh, kick he's out. He's the heart of a warrior here tonight. The warrior. Ooh, yeah. He'll be feeling the effects of that for a while. That's not the warrior, I know. <laughs> watch it. Watch it. Just every time I think of the ultimate warrior, I think of Randy Savage. Will this do it? For some reason, I I don't understand it. Oh, he countered that, you sneaky little shit! Uh oh. I gotta make this count. Ooh. And we're gonna pick him up, and we're gonna do this. Hopefully he bleeds. Is now in charge here. What a finishing move. This could be it right here. He is just getting busted up. Make him bleed. No? Okay, well. He doesn't need to bleed. Oh, and he eats the canvas. God damn it. He just kind of glitched out there a little bit. I don't know if you guys noticed that. Now we make him bleed. Bleed him. No. Oh my god. Countered without using a counter. The fucking broken mechanics. Okay. That did some serious damage. You can't okay, bleed you. you. Thank you. There's five star match right there. Another five star victim. He's too busy bragging and boasting the battle of this matchup. Nope. He countered that. Hey, he's probably gonna go for his submission. Yeah. There it is. Will he get me though? Pretty fucking close. Almost got me. Would have had me if that orb hadn't shown up in my favor. But I kick out. But I kick out. We're looking at complete domination here. There we go. Pick him up. And oh. What happened? Oh, oh! In the middle of next week. Oh, this is not going to be good. Death, right there. That's go. it. Here we go. He's hanging on for dear life. Oh, fucking orb. Submit. Boom. What a win! Man, he's got to feel great. Lunatic fringe down. No Randy Orton. Good. That submission hold is deadly. Oh yeah. Alright. Meanwhile, in Randy Orton's match. Oh no! Look out! Boom! Randy Orton down. Fortunately, that's all I can do. So, we'll see what happens with Orton.
So Orton still won. But we move on to SmackDown where I face Ryback. Wow. What we do? Perform two signatures during your match. Hmm. Let's do some skill building. So put um Grapple offense up. Running offense. Uh, let's get that up a little bit. Aerial offense, eh. Range, maybe. Foreign object. I don't use foreign objects. Strike reversal. Grapple reversal. Aerial reversal? No. Pin escape is good enough. Springboard, I still don't have any springboard moves, so it's pointless. Arm power, leg power, head power, body durability, arm durability, movement speed. And we have 180 left, so that's all I can do. That's good. 79 overall. We're almost at 80. All right. I could probably buy like some skills or something. Maybe. And we have a lot of stuff that we can actually we can actually afford now. Through the table. Skull crushing big boot. Mm. Suicide dive. I totally regret buying that move because I haven't used it at all. And it doesn't really give you any like memorable moments during your match. Whereas like barricade breaker heightens the drama, giving you more skills towards a five star match. But whatever. Ryback. Maybe the one wrestler that I'm actually glad, other than Santino Morella, that is actually gone now. But let's add some insult to injury. 